Hello everyone, so today um, I'm really excited to be here and um, we're all excited to be here to represent our beautiful culture of Cambodia. Um, and so I've actually presented down this year, every single year for almost 10 years and this is my first time presenting um, a dance performance with live music. So we're really you know, grateful to be here um, to present this to you all. Um, just a little bit about Kimono's Kashua Dance. It is a sacred art form that is over a thousand years old. It was developed as a prayer and movement and dancers were the living embodiment of the carvings of Mongo. They are believed to be the messengers and the bridge between heaven and earth and communicate um, the um, communicate you know the messages from um, the king, the people, um, to the gods with their dances. So during April, while it's the driest month of the year, the kings would have mousu or prayer ceremonies to provide offerings, such as dance offerings, um, to ask for a year of abundant rain, um, prosperity, and just protection from the empire. In Cambodian classical dance, um, there are over 4,500 gestures that makes up the dance vocabulary. I'm going to demonstrate the four gestures with you, and I'd like you to join in with me. So first we have the tree, which is the pointing finger. And we're going to move it up to represent the tree growing. And what do trees have? Leaves. Leaves. Flowers. So this flower, this is the bud in the middle, and these are the petals. And then we have fruit. When the fruit ripes, it falls, and the seed grows another tree, and the whole cycle starts over. And so there's a lot of um, themes surrounding nature in Cameron Costco dance. But that does not mean every time they point, they're telling you that a tree is growing. Um, these gestures are put together to um, demonstrate actions such as love and sadness, or it can just have little meanings saying, I am, or me, I can say, I am happy. Um, or they can be um, demonstrating actions such as flying. So if you can imagine my <laughs> leg kicking back, um, that is a flying gesture. Um, and so, our gestures and postures are curvy linear, and this is representative of serpents or snakes um, swimming in water, which is symbolic for fertility and rain. So today we're going to be presenting the Bam Nidiji Jewel, which is a dance describing ladies in line um, and admiring all of our beautiful arts and cultures that or sorry, arts and traditions that um, were created by our ancestors. And we're so happy to be here and to present this dance with you, for you today. So please enjoy the Bam Nediji Jewel accompanied by the Ho Chi Minh Ensemble.